On Sunday, April 13, 1919, a bullet-riddled World War I Army tank, delivered by train, arrived in Colorado Springs at the Santa Fe station. It was all part of a publicity stunt to promote the purchase of victory loans, bonds to help pay for the costs of World War I. The city fire siren was sounded to alert residents of the arrival of the tank, and several thousand people gathered at the unloading track south of the depot. The following morning, the tank left the Mark Scheffel garage, where it had spent the night, and paraded through the business district where it was formally christened Little Zeb, in honor of Zebulon Pike by Mrs. Florence Marshall Stote. The event was photographed and filmed. The goal of the stunt was to have the tank climb up Pike's Peak, where it would reside indefinitely. But the tank never made it. Heavy snowdrifts and ice flows broke the tank's track plate near Glen Cove. Despite repair efforts, the climb was discontinued. However, the tank broke a few world records. When it passed the 11,000 foot mark, it was 4,000 feet higher than any other tank had been before. It also had traveled higher on Pikes Peak than any other vehicle had ever gone at that time of year.